Hey, can you move that over, Skosh? The video shows you what it's like, but the audio takes you there. All right, that's a wrap. Well done, Houston. Congratulations on a great commercial project. And congratulations on becoming a professor. Thank you. Being your TA has been a lot of fun, but now it's time for me to spread my wings. You know, your, uh, your students seem fairly good. How about a friendly competition? What did you have in mind? Let's make a bet. Whoever student creates the best 30 second commercial wins. Ha! <laughs> You're on. All right, it's time for you to show your grit. I need you to make me the best 30 second commercial of all time. And remember, it has to be better than his. And remember, it has to be better than his. All right, Professor Wells, I won't let you down. Uh, okay, uh, I can do that. Oh, hey, could you uh, help me with the voice recording for a sec? Oh, yeah, sure. <clears throat> yes. It's me, live in Weimar Hall, Zach Nall Powell here. Oh, yay. I think the audio sounds great. I think the levels are exactly on point. It's me, live in Weimar Hall, Zach Nall Powell. Wow, yeah. My student has such quality camera work. This is going to look really great on TV. Today's Saturday. Your student returned with a bad commercial, didn't they? Yep. You too? Unfortunately. Truce? Yes, please. Let's agree to never speak of this again. And so the tale that no one knows between the dashing Houston Wells and his sidekick Tim Sorrell remains untold. Wells, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> I was just, the door was unlocked. I was cleaning up in here. I just, I, 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 I'm not really sure what to tell you, Tim. I, um, I, I, I was just, you know, working. I saw the microphone. I sat down.